uh, weather app. Send in your weather pictures with the app as well. It's free to download. Well, today Heather Kyle Harmon with the UT extension talks about him. It's a new program they've developed to offer health information for men. And here she is to explain why it's so important. Um, because men's health is increasingly a public health concern. So while um, men's health has improved over time, the life expectancy for men is still shorter than that of women. And generally speaking, um, men are less likely to visit their doctors than women. So there's been a series of lessons that have been created, and I'm gonna highlight some in the next few sessions um, with you guys, just to address some of these issues regarding men's health. So the first one we're gonna talk about is sleep, the importance of sleep in our lives. So we're gonna first talk about the consequences of losing sleep. So in the US, three in 10 working adults sleep six hours of less or less in a 24 hour period. So when you sleep less than six hours per night, it increases your risk of stroke by 27%, obesity by 21%, diabetes by 25%, and coronary heart disease by 35%. So it's so important for our bodies that we get that rest. So there are five warning signs that you need sleep. The first one is you start to doze off while you're driving. You're forgetful or you make mistakes. You feel fatigued and lack of energy. You're irritable, grouchy, or you lose your temper really easily. Or you rely on caffeine to get through the day. So the, the recommended priority is that we all get seven hours of sleep each night, especially men. So there's some strategies to help us do that. Um, we need to create a nighttime routine. So we stress that with children the same way with adults. So unplug, make sure you unplug from your gaming devices, your iPads, TV, phone, all of those things, um, at least 30 minutes to an hour before you uh, lie down at night to go to sleep. The next one is don't eat or drink late at night. Um, pick a consistent bedtime, really important. Try to get up at, in, in the morning at the same time and go to bed at night at the same time. Make a to-do list. That can help with all those thoughts churning in our mind. So try to make a to-do list and knock those things out. Um, and then you have your list for in the morning and you don't have to stress about it anymore. Um, and then the last one is read a good book. Meditate, breathe, just do something to help yourself calm down and relax so that you can get your seven hours of sleep. This has been Heather Kyle Harmon with UT Extension. And tune in next time for some more Him. Health information for men.